Jessa Dagger and Ben Seawold would like your attention. They have a very special announcement to make. It may not come as a huge surprise to those that have been paying close attention or who know anything about their famous family, but that doesn't make it any less blessed or miraculous. You've probably guessed by now, haven't you? Did the thumbnail give it away? Or the title? Or the fact that it's been a year or two? Oh well, we're still gonna come out and scream it from the virtual rooftops. Jessa Dagger and Ben Seawold are expecting another child. We're looking forward to summertime, and here's our number one reason. Thank you God for this precious gift, wrote the couple as a caption to the ultrasound photo. They included the hashtag HashRainbowBaby along with the message because Jessa sadly suffered a miscarriage in 2020. Already parents to 5-year-old son Spurgeon, 4-year-old son Henry and 1-year-old daughter Ivy, Jess and Ben sent the following to TLC on Thursday. After the heartbreaking loss of a baby last year, we're overjoyed to share that another little Seawold is on the way. No word yet on whether Jessa is growing a boy or a girl inside of her womb. In early December, a bunch of astute observers wondered whether or not Jessa was pregnant, simply based on a photograph of her in sweet pants. It seemed silly at the time. However, if Dagger really is due this summer, then she likely did have a bun in her oven at the time. We apologize for making fun of anyone who jumped to this conclusion, even if it's sort of rude and inappropriate to spread pregnancy rumors about a woman on the internet prior to confirmation. In any case, there's nothing but joy in Taunty Town now. The pregnancy is going smoothly, and both Baby and Jessa are doing well, added Dagger and Seawold when speaking to TLC. We are so grateful to God for the precious gift of a new life. The kids are delighted, and we can hardly wait to welcome this little one into our arms this summer. Jess and Ben got married in November of 2014 in their home state of Arkansas. Their relationship was documented on 19 Kids in Counton until it went off the air in 2015, at which time they then joined the family TLC spin-off Counting On. The pair welcomed their first child together in 2015 and have remained committed to a great deal of procreating ever since. Spurgeon and Henry are very excited. They understand, Jessa tells this cable network. We have little pregnancy apps on my phone that we look at and they get to see updates of the baby's progress and growth. Jess and Ben's impending child will be the latest addition to the Duggar family, becoming Jean, Bob and Michelle's the 21st grandchild. Yup, they've got 19 kids and soon to be 21 grandkids. In an inexplicable and related gender run, the 28-year-old Jessa gave birth to her daughter Ivy in May 2019. Since then, six baby girls have been born into the family, with Kendra Duggar expecting the seventh this month. Amazing, right? Will Jess and Ben keep this pattern going? Or will they break it up with a son? The husband and wife have yet to find out the gender of the forthcoming child while he or she has been in the utero, but Jessa now hints this could change with baby number four. These two have been less inclined to embrace the hoopla of gender reveal parties and spectacles of the like than some of their siblings, which we applaud them for. There are no bad outcomes, after all. Whether it's a boy or a girl, however, we're certain the kid will receive a great deal of love, and also a great number of hand-me-downs. Like so many hand-me-downs. Congratulations to the entire immediate family and the extended family, so many aunts, uncles, cousins and friends. We can't wait to meet this bundle of joy in a few months, along with the rest of the family's forthcoming members. That's it for now, thank you for watching, please subscribe to stay tuned.